Hello everybody, I am Aubrey Autumn and welcome to another video. Now we're playing some more Bioshock. So uh we are in the Garden of Eden at the minute. Just been baptized by the uh priest. And uh back where we left off. Let's go through the door. And we're greeted by the city of Columbia. And the weirdest thing is is I don't get how the hell these things float. Oh, that's what they're... Oh, that's how they float. So they've got big jet things on the bottom of them, I think. I don't know. I've never had an oyster. I bet we could have something <laughs> arranged. You are terrible. Morning. Good to see you. Hi. Anything else? No. Okay then. Day for the celebration. Father Comstock must have seen the transcript of the prophet's recent address to you, the Colombian people, on the holy forgiveness of our dear lady Comstock, our beloved mother of forgiveness. You're really small. I'm guessing this is the prophet. Oh, I'm statue. I just think it fails to capture Father Comstock's absolute, you know, divinity. Yeah, I do. Salt Salt's all right, I tell you. Says he's for faith, family, and fatherland. Who could be against all that? I don't know. Somebody actually knows the truth. Pilgrims, welcome. My dear fellow, they are a temperamental and unreliable lot to a man. Uh huh. I told him that the park is exceedingly far behind schedule. The the, the landscaping is half finished. The, the statuary hasn't arrived. The oh, fountain please. is full of rainwater, for God's sake. Stock is stolen. Prophet for sees bright sunshine. I don't know. The word of the prophet. And the marigolds are still unplanted. All work which should have been done months ago. Shut up. Uh -huh. Do you know what he told me? He said that he was tired. That that the work had taken much from him. I said. Hmm. Now, if you remember on the um, sheet that we got, Fox Popular, that now what does Fox Popular even mean by heaven's sake? Um, in the suitcase there was a thing that had a key, a uh, cage on it. Now, um. Um, cage on it, so I'm wondering if that's something. Dear God, why would you put just just some uh, Picking the right some regular money in the day like today is serious business, business, you know. Can't be everywhere at once. <laughs> You'll always miss something. That's why we're going to the raffle. Yep. Columbia <laughs> raffle and fair. <laughs> He's strong in the sword, but a bit weak in the key and the scroll. If you get my meaning. Is this girl? 
It's her. That's how it is, Booker. And light variable winds throughout the afternoon. Oh, no in short, a beautiful day for the festivities, Columbia. Kick. And now, lovely kick. Back to the music. Da 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 da. Almost got the achievement. What? Boutonniere? We're raising money for the girls' patriotic league. <laughs> Maybe next time. You'd look dashing with one in your lapel. Come back if you change your mind. Okay, hippie. Cushion. Oh, don't Not turn it. into some faint and radical on me, John. I do not want to be some character out of I Married a Box Popular, now do I? Yeah, that's where they said I'd find her. Oh. Telegram, Mr. DeWitt. Huh. Telegram for you, sir. Okay. DeWitt, stop. Do not alert Comstock to your presence, stop. Whatever you do, do not pick number 77, stop. Lutess. What the... Oh. Why, good day to you, sir. Hello. Yes, say hello there. <laughs> As I would say. I agree. Keep saying you believe me? Should we if go I in? If I told you a man could hoist a one-ton stallion straight into the air, would you believe me? Well, friends, I am here today to tell. Those are no flights of fancy. Those are no tall tales told behind the pool hall. No, sir. No, ma'am. Those are vigors I'm talking about. Brought to you courtesy of Mr. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. Here. Find the devil, good sir, and cast him out. Young sir, young miss, roll up and try the amazing power of Bucking Bronco. Whether you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, Bucking Bronco is just the ticket. And there's devil number one. Got number one. With number two. Oh, you are. Devil number two. Woo, he's on a roll. I know I am. And you're over there. And that's three. We have a winner. Yay! Yeah. There you go, friend. And remember, if you need it lifted, lofted, tossed, or tumbled, fucking Bronco is your answer. Yeah, I know. I know. Those dirty box are at it again. See them villains zipping around, spreading their lies and dissent? Good man. Now take aim and blast those evil box out of the sky. Hit enough and I'll get you a prize. Ten points, twenty points, five points. Okay. Oh, this fella knows his stuff. That'll teach him. No, no, no. Not like that. For the record! Almost there, keep it up! 
Ah. Damn it. Keep the skies clear. Grab a gun and show those box who runs this city. Clear the skylines and earn Right, got that. So I can't. Ding. Oh, sorry. Don't get anything. And their heads are vibrating. It's lovely, and you're smoking both sides. Lovely. Break a leg. You do break a leg because you bloody what happens dogs, when the piston breaks. Hot dogs, Alexander hot dogs. The Call me his finest. Worth every cent. Box of hot hot dogs. Box of hot hot dogs. Hear your voice from the past. The 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 has arrived. Say something, Sonny. What's a voxophone? What's a voxophone? Exactly that. A personal record of voice. Hey, just so we're clear, I'm not paying for this. Just a demonstration, sir. Okay. Have you sampled any of the new vigors here today? I usually Make a memoir. Record a ditty. Recite poetry for your little lady and play a tag. Hey, you. Okay, that's good to know. Looking to do your part for Columbia. What's in here? Book and Bronco. Don't go. Show your skill by hunting down Daisy Fitzroy and the vile members of the Box Populi. Shoot the targets, earn I'll the try. points, win the prize. Ten points Where to get that. Okay. Here's a brave fellow. Now, shoot the Box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. A fine show. I want to get the main one. Come on. Well, here's a brave fellow. Now, shoot the box when they appear, get it up, and you'll win a prize. I'll even throw in a bonus if you bag the anarchist Daisy Fitzroy. Well done, sir. That's three. A fine show. A fine show. A crack shot. There she is. Daisy Fitzroy. Columbia can sleep soundly once more. A natural gun sleep. A fine show. A fine show. A magnificent Yay. of marksmanship. The box defeated. Daisy Fitzroy slain. You, sir, shall be richly rewarded. Mm. Step right up and see the eighth wonder of the world. He's big, he's bold, he's the amazing handyman. Only in our fair city will you see such amazing feats of technological prowess. Have you ever seen anything like it? He looks so sad. Sad? When you're that strong, what's there to be sad about? Dear friend, have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? Give me one of those. With just a whisper. They're all ears. Mm. <laughs> okay then. Um. Press to turn machines into allies. Okay. So I gotta use it over that. Well, if they 
isn't as sublim in Buford. Your spot at the raffle awaits. Heads. Or tails. Come on, let me through. Heads. Or tails. Huh. Tails. Heads. Told you. Hmm. I never find that as satisfying as I'd imagined. Chin up. There's always next time. I suppose there is. The children from the sky when the young ones misbehave escorts children. What have we got in here? Yeah, it's fine. Uh. One gun. Good on it. My role model? When did you get that? This little beauty? Ah, the whole division got them. If we're gonna flush the box out of the Skyline system, uh, we gotta have the best. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's all what? That's creepy. Okay. That's all right. Okay. Uh, fix up the box phone. I'm kind of Madam Lutef, I have read all your books on the sciences. Mama says it's not a fit occupation for a lady, but I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you are allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, I should like to meet her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance. <laughs> Look at that. Oh god, that's funny. It's like I'm the false shepherd, I think. We'll see about that. I'm feeling lucky. I'm going to go And now, the 1912 raffle has officially begun! Hey, mister! Mister! Sorry. No sale. <laughs> Silly. There's never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock? Seventy-seven. Seventy-seven. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me okay. the bowl! Is that not the prettiest young white girl in all of Colombia? <laughs> Racist. All right, then. Racist. The winner is number seventy-seven! Well, what do you know? Number 77, come and claim your prize! First throw! First throw, first throw! Please, please don't do this. It was me, it was all me, please, please! No. Please, what are you doing? Come on, are you gonna throw it? Or are you taking your coffee black these days? <laughs> Let her go, please! I'm the one you want! Oh! <laughs> looks like we've got a shy one here! Uh, I'll do that because I... Wait! <laughs> it's him! <laughs> now, where'd you get that brand, uh, boy? Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? The false shepherd! And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock! <laughs> Show him what we got planned, boys! Uh oh. <laughs> Well, this is getting a bit gruesome very quickly. But really getting gruesome very quickly. Don't 
Okay then. Right, so guys, I think this is going to be the end of episode 2. Um, if you like what you've seen, leave a like down below. One little click. And also, if you like what you see as well, from all of this, and from my channel, uh, if you'd like to subscribe, you can. Another little click down below. It's completely free. And uh, I'll be doing more of these episodes. So I've been Marby Autumn, guys, and see you later.